Hey there, Scorpios, and welcome back from the weekend, and happy Memorial Day to those of you in the United States. Well, it's kind of a funky day up in the stars. We have two soul pyramids going on, one in air and one in fire. Now, the fire soul pyramid will go on for several days, so we're going to talk about that tomorrow and focus today on the air soul pyramid. For those of you new to Soul Garden, a soul pyramid is created by three planets that kind of triangulate around the Earth and form 60-degree relationships to each other. That 60 degree relationship is kind of like a gravity harmonic and so those planets for that period of time work well with each other and how it translates down here on the planet itself is that we just kind of feel integrated in those three areas of our life. And for you Scorpio, the three areas are very private ones. It is actually created by the moon in Libra which through the whole weekend has been giving you an emotional tour of your subconscious and basement issues. It's in the 12th house basically, the house of higher faith or faith in yourself and also the house of karma and subconscious issues, the things that keep us from feeling or having faith in ourselves. If I were to summarize the soul pyramid air as simply as possible, I'd say the universe is going to try to show you or demonstrate or maybe even help you come to this awareness where you will begin to feel the new faith in yourself. You will feel this new faith in yourself. Now what's tying into it is Mercury in the house of intimacy. Part of this new faith deals with you really communicating your boundaries and also being clear yourself on what your boundaries are. That was a huge hemorrhaging part of Scorpio's energy. They've been letting a lot of people take things away from them because they're so loyal to them. Then on the other hand, Neptune, which is trying to help you intuitively create a new family structure and a new way of taking care of yourself, then incorporate obviously having faith in yourself and drawing the right boundaries. So today you might be grumpy, you might not. I don't know, frankly, I don't have enough air time with this particular topic. It's a very quick soul pyramid. It only happens every so often due to the fact that two of the planets in it are fast moving planets. But either way, I think your emotion today will be tied, really, to this subconscious current. Just go with it, because the universe is giving you a glimpse of the future. All right, Scorp, that's all we got for the first day of the week. That's a lot, huh? We'll see you tomorrow with more Soul Horoscopes. Live, love, be. So